Dynamic Light Scattering DLS, is an excellent tool for characterizing the size of proteins, polymers, colloids or nanomaterials from below a nanometer to several micrometers. But we also know that even small numbers of large particles, which may or may not be of interest, can dominate the DLS signal of smaller particles. This makes data interpretation difficult and uncertain. Large particles may be sample agglomerates and aggregates, or extrinsic contamination from dirty labware or filter spoil, typically referred to as dust. While careful sample preparation can help, it can be time-consuming, unreliable, and can adversely change the sample. Now there's a new way, adaptive correlation. Adaptive correlation allows scientists to accurately characterize samples quickly, confidently, and precisely, with less sample preparation, and brings additional insight into the presence of rare large particles. Let's take a closer look. In a DLS measurement, particles are illuminated by a laser beam, scattering the light. As the particles diffuse, the intensity of this detected light fluctuates over time. These fluctuations are analyzed to produce a correlation function, which is used to determine the particle diffusion rate, from which the particle size can be obtained. The quality of the size measurement, therefore, depends on the quality of this correlation function. Scattering intensity depends on a number of factors, but in general, larger particles scatter more light than smaller particles. DLS measurements are highly sensitive to even small amounts of large particles, so a single dust particle diffusing across the laser beam can dominate the results. To compensate for these effects, measurements are typically performed for longer periods, averaging out these effects. While this reduces the impact of dust, it does not eliminate it and results in longer measurement times. Adaptive correlation is different. With adaptive correlation, many short measurements or subruns are automatically performed and inspected, and the data classified using statistical procedures. The main result describes the particles that are always present, the steady state particles, and a new additional result describes transient particles that intermittently appear such as dust or aggregates. With this approach, a more accurate and reliable particle size is reported, without data being skewed by unrepresentative particles. For applications where aggregate or large particle detection is critical to quality, the transient data gives a better indication of the presence and size of these larger particles and a measure of their frequency of occurrence. Adaptive correlation is a patented technique that is only available with Malvern Panalytical's new Zeta Sizer Pro and Zeta Sizer Ultra. By making measurements more tolerant to dust, sample preparation becomes quicker and easier, measuring is faster, and the data is significantly more reliable, improving throughput and streamlining the whole characterization process. It also gives more insight into the presence of aggregates or other oversized particles within a sample. To find out more about how adaptive correlation can help you solve your particle characterization problems, contact your nearest Malvern Panalytical representative today.